Hi guys, I'm Lakitus, and uh, welcome back to Surviving Mars. It's uh, not been too long since the last recording, but I figured I would just bring this. This is going to be a very short little clip, just a little bit of an extension to the previous video. It's actually the same evening. I'm still recording this on the launch day. Um, no pun intended. Uh, we found a big old pile of minerals down here, which we've got a couple of transports uh, busy harvesting. Uh, I found out that uh, after playing around a bit, that you can actually set sort of uh, transport routes with them. So I've set them to collect it continuously and load it back here. And we've got our dome just completed and ready to go. And we've actually got down here, 88% of the way here, our first load of colonists. So I figured I'd turn the uh, turn the old recording back on just in time. What are these guys doing? Oh, they're just. Uh, Pile of minerals onto the uh, metal platform, just redistributing things a little bit. Uh, we could probably do a bring in some fuel over to this guy, I guess. I oh, know they're doing it on their own, so that's okay. They do have the range to do it. Now they've finished building everything, they can get on with doing their routine maintenance. The drones are just uh, busy droning around. Got drone ports covering the area of the colony pretty well. Uh, when this ship's ready to launch, we'll clear that away as well, and I think we're going to probably get a second dome built over here at some point to mine these minerals here. And see if we can also mine these rare resources over here. Maybe build another dome over here as well, because we're going to need more habitation. I'm wondering... Can you connect up the domes? I mean, seems like something you should be able to do with. Oh, I see literally the tunnels go right underground and... Okay, that's kind of cool. I'm guessing how much it costs to connect them depends on... Uh, So domes, we've got basic domes at the moment. I guess I want to come research more. So I hope, I really do hope you can connect these airlocks to other domes. It just seems like something that makes sense. That have like a you know little walkways and roads. And here we have Collective One, our first rocket, ironically, after we sent back to Earth, ready to land our first load of passengers. Uh, I think, yeah, there will do about as well as any. Uh, we can also unload all the food it's brought with us. And here we go. Here are our first colonies. Colonists, rather. Coming down to the surface now. Ready? Here they come. Full of hope and determination, the first founders have set foot on the Red Planet. So yeah, now we get the colony evaluated. We've got to get uh, ten souls of uh, no problems, and then we get let me go allowed to bring in more colonists, which is good, because I've built more stuff than I have the colonists to man at the moment with ten guys. But, uh, yeah, we'll see. The first twelve guys, rather. And here they come. That is one small step for man. One giant leap for mankind. Okay. Once they're all out of the ship, we're going to pause it for a second. Let's have a look at these guys. So we have Bayava Amin. Can you rename these people? Yeah, you can, but I'm not going to right now. So we have Bayava Amin, and she is 
adult, she's a geologist, and she's going to go work in the metal extractor. And she is composed, she's a founder, and she's a hypochondriac. Uh, okay, that's fine, I've got medical facilities. And uh, we've got Chang Yu, who is lazy. Uh, individual job performance decreased by 20%. I'm okay with that. He's also a geologist. Uh, he's a survivor. So he loses less health if things go drastically wrong. And he's a vegan. Don't worry, they'll tell you. Uh, so what have we got here? Uh, we have Ira Dahlberg. Who is it also an adult? She's an engineer, and she's a gamer. Uh, open after my own heart. We have Kung Huang. Uh, he's got no particular specialization. He's going to work at the grocers. He's also a gamer. He's a genius. Uh, generates research one in the colony. That is awesome. And he's religious, uh, so he's not that much of a genius, in my opinion. <laughs> Sorry, I know I've offended 90% of the people out there, but uh, screw you. Uh, higher individual-based morale, low sanity never leads to suicide. Uh, we've got this guy, who is Erwin Anderson. He's a medic, and he's going to work in the hydroponics farm. Uh, I think we're going to have a little fiddle with these guys' specializations once they're all set up, because I kind of feel he should be working in the clinic, really, rather than the hydroponics one, but uh, he's melancholic, increases performance penalty while at low morale, but I hopefully will keep him happy. And he's a nerd. He likes new tech. And uh, we have uh, Clyde Hudson. He's a hippie, gains twice as much comfort in gardens and parks. That's finally built my garden. He's also a gamer. There's a lot of gamers out here. I probably should build some kind of uh, gaming facility, I note. Uh, he's going to work in the space bar, and he's an adult. No specialization. Another adult. Uh, Siddharth Chabra. Uh, he's an alcoholic, or she's an alcoholic. I'm not sure of the uh, gender of that name. Uh, can be caused by sanity. likes drinking. So, well, there's a bar, so she'll be alright. Oh, let's unpause this then, because I can't actually select the rest of these guys. Because they're still on the spaceship. New colonists have arrived. Lawrence Trenton. He's another geologist. He is fit. Uh, they're all founders, obviously. More health recovered while resting can work when health is low. Alessia Travosa. She's an adult, she's an engineer. And she is an enthusiast. Increased performance proof. Uh, she is sexy. Greatly increased birth rate. <laughs> and party animal gains additional comfort when satisfying social interest. So we found the colony bicycle then. Wink, wink. Uh, Chang Luo. Uh, he's a youth. He's the only uh, young member. So uh, everyone else is a sort of uh, standard-aged adult, I guess. There's a lot of Chinese guys on this mission as well. I'm not saying. Oh, I didn't notice the birthplace of China. Where are all these guys from? Let's just uh, uh, Indian. I think that is. Apologies for getting the flags wrong here. China. Sweden. Another Chinese man. Oh, middle-aged guy. This one is a bit older. Uh, you got an American, Edward Anderson's from the States. Uh, we've got Clyde Hudson, also from the States. Uh, Siddharth. Ah, it tells you the gender. Siddharth Chandra is indeed a male, and he's from India. Lawrence Trenton is American. Uh, 
Alessa Travosa is a sexy Russian. <laughs> We have a Chinese youth, Chang Luo, and he's a scientist. He's going to work in the infirmary. He's also an alcoholic. And then we have Elisa Christophe, and she is French. And she is composed. And she's a glutton. She eats double rations. Well, that should be expected of the French, really. They do like their food. And she's also religious, so... And lastly, we have Courtney Carson, who is a youth, and she is also a glutton and an alcoholic. Uh, so, uh... Probably not the best colonist on the party, but, uh... She's an American. I, I could make a joke about Americans and overeating and overindulging, uh, but... I kind of have, so... Right, so, uh, it's just we build a research lab. I would love to build a research lab, but first of all, let's just get these colonists into the building. Let's see how they uh, they come inside here. And they change into their uniforms. There, immediately, and we get our first look at our colonists. This is what the sexy one looks like. That's sexy if you ask me. <laughs> kind of looks like a generic sprite. Uh, now I wonder, are the uniforms... If I pause this a sec, are they... Uh, Spacebar... Metals Extractor... Hydroponics Farm... Grocer... Machine Parts Factory... Infirmary. Yeah, their outfits look like they are. Spacebar. Spacebar, yeah. So their outfits are based around where they work. Okay. Uh, so yeah, that is the colony founded. So with that, I'm going to call another end to this video here. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.